traveled all over the United States and Canada. Uh, we bought an RV, and my wife and I and our dogs, we and my son, have traveled all over the western part of the United States, which is my favorite spot. Places such as Wyoming, Grand Canyon, Carmel, California, uh, Banff, Canada, Alberta, Canada is a really hot spot for artists. I strongly recommend for people to go there. British Columbia, Acadia National Park. I can keep on going, but all practically all over the United States, and sometimes the same place several times. I've done at least a thousand paintings outdoors. I started with oils first, because that's the, the most benign medium first. And then I saw this watercolor artist who was very good, and I really fell in love with watercolor, so I worked with that for several years. And now, I, with, because of that, I can work with all the mediums. Once you can master, it takes a whole life to do that, but once you can master oils and watercolor, then everything else falls off the brush pretty easily. One day, I visited a forum called Wet Canvas, which is a gathering of lots of artists, and they were talking about certain techniques, and there was a confusion going on, and so I wanted to participate in that and give them my opinion of how things should be uh, done as far as dark values in paintings. I don't want to elaborate on that, but um, that sparked the interest of other people. I volunteered to give them some online classes for free just so that they could understand 150 people signed up right away. We all enjoyed it. I got a lot of compliments from the students, and all, so I figured this should go, get grow into something much bigger. And uh, so I contacted F&W Media, and I said to them, have you read what's going on in your wet canvas forum? And they took a look at it, and they were pleased with the results that the students were commenting. And so we got together, and we spoke about uh, bringing this to a bigger, bigger level, which is online classes, and from then on, it's been a beautiful venture for me to be able to offer what I know to all these students all around the world. What pleases me a lot is that I get emails from them. Some of them have won awards now. Some of them are professional instructors themselves. And they found ways to convey ideas, even though they knew the technique, but they didn't verbalize it. For example, a, a, a three-step, 12 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 4 o'clock, etc., for the clock for teaching color mixture. They borrowed that. and that really helped the students a lot. So it's wonderful.